Hello everyone, my name is Kushbu and in this video I am going to discuss with you about the roadmap for learning statistics and also meanwhile I will be discussing about what are the job roles for which you should learn statistics means if you are someone who is willing to transit into data science domain or data analyst domain if you want to become a business analyst or business intelligence developer so for all these job profiles this statistics plays a very very important role now the next thing comes what is the exact way of learning statistics in which manner in which order should you learn statistics so as discussed in the previous video this whole statistics world falls under two types that is descriptive and inferential okay in this video we will be discussing about what are all those topics that falls under descriptive and what are all those topics that falls under inferential let's first have a discussion about descriptive and then we'll move to inferential so in my previous video what i told about descriptive statistics is that here mainly we used to understand our data and what what kind of things we used to perform we used to analyze our data we used to visualize our data and we used to summarize our data and in total if i say in simpler word we used to understand our data okay under descriptive statistics the main aim is to understand the data and now the next thing comes after understanding the data you need to reach to a final conclusion means you need to conclude something okay so which we used to do inside this inferential statistics make conclusion okay so the main aim of this statistics is to understand the data and make conclusion and this thing is divided into two types of statistics that is descriptive and inferential under descriptive what we used to do we used to understand the data okay that's it this is the main thing that we used to do inside descriptive statistics and inferential is all about making conclusion to reach out to a final result okay now let's discuss the topics that we will be discussing about descriptive and what are the topics that you should actually focus on so the first thing is population and sample if you are going to learn statistics the first thing you need to keep in your mind that whatever kind of analysis that you will be performing on the data that data will be the sample data okay that data will be the sample data that data is not going to be the population data why because this population data is very very huge in size that you will not be able to perform any kind of analysis so this sample data is collected out of this population data in order to perform the analysis now the next topic comes sampling methods what are the different different sampling methods or techniques next thing is measure of central tendency basically there are three measure of central tendency that you should know that is mean median and mood we'll discuss about each one of that one by one in the coming videos now the next thing is variable and its type this is also a very very important topic what is variable what are the types of variable what does each type mean so basically there are two types of measure of dispersion that is variance and standard deviation this is also very very important we will understand about these all things next one is five number summary this is very very important in context of data science because when we used to go for project work so at that time you should basically understand this five number summary and accordingly we used to analyze the data the next topic is probability permutation and combination the next topic is covariance pearson correlation coefficient and spearman correlation coefficient so basically these three when we will go in sequence this is very very interesting we will see about each one of this in the playlist next one is central limit theorem cbcf's inequality one more thing that i left here is z code 
we will learn about these all topics inside descriptive statistics now these are all the topics that if you are going to cover inside descriptive statistics that is more than enough now moving towards the inferential statistics let's see what are the topics that we should focus on the first topic is hypothesis testing so this hypothesis testing is one of the very very important topic inside statistics which will let you analyze the data next one is errors there is basically two types of error that is type 1 error and type 2 error we will discuss about each one of that the next topic is confidence interval after that j test t test anova test which is also called as f test and the last one is chi square test basically all these tests we used to perform on our data set so that to draw out some kind of conclusion so these all tests are very very important we will look about each one of these tests in our playlist so i hope you understood like what are the topics that needs to be covered under descriptive and what are the topics that needs to be covered under inferential one more thing i want to mention here this is not about theoretical understanding of each of these topic what i'm explaining you should also implement it or uh, in other sense you should also do the practical implementation of all these topics then only you are going to get a full flesh or full command on the statistics part so i hope you understood what are all the topics that you need to cover inside statistics if you are going to cover all these topics that is mentioned on the screen your statistics part will be over so that's it for this video if you have any question in your mind please ping me in the comment box i'll be happy to reply thank you so much for watching this video